Greetings and salutations. Welcome back to this Let's Play of EU4, the Randomonium game. I'm Keb. And I'm Perry. And hopefully I'll be able to win a board this time. And hopefully we'll be able to move off of slow. When you're ready. Yeah, fine, you can move up. That's no, okay. no, no, it's fine for your war. Uh, I, it, it, there's only one army for me to watch at the moment, so... Yeah, but I'd rather keep it on slow for now and give you better control to re reduce the chance of a stack wipe than having to listen to a stack wipe. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, well, it, all right. yeah. it's still pure greed on my part, but it's... I will... Yeah, I'm just trying to unseat my capital, among other things. Is that like unscrewing a light bulb? Uh, possibly. Uh, my goodness, I really should have looked at the number of ships before I started this mess. Because they have one heck of a fleet. That, or I'm seeing the same fleet in two places or something. Or it's their colonial state, maybe, I don't know. Well, let's get answers, shall we? The Netherlands has a total of 92 ships, 26 heavies, 40 lights, 26 transports. Okay, then there was their own there's their fleet split in two then. Okay. <sighs> yeah, and my sh ships are mostly obsolete ones, so I can kind of understand why they went bloob in a big way. I still have Carax, quite a few Carax. You have Carax? Oh, yes. Well, even I don't have those. I haven't upgraded the ships, and yeah, kind of hurt for it. Uh, maybe I should do that now. I do have two deckers, don't I? I have two deckers. So, yeah, Carrick's are several are many generations ago. Yeah, yeah, I tend to be bad about upgrading my ships because they tend to sink. Um, well, if you upgraded them the right way, they wouldn't sink. Not like you're fighting a fallen empire. Uh, upgrading this would cost 9,000, okay, 2,000 ducats to upgrade that, okay? No. Don't think you're gonna do that. <laughs> So what's the, the end goal? What's the goal here with, with Netherlands? What are you taking from them? Everything. <laughs> uh, basically, well, that, I, that's I, yeah. more succinct than I thought. Cool. <laughs> I'm going to take as much as I possibly can. Uh, aggressive expansion be damned. That's basically my uh, <laughs> thought here. So much, for the, so much for getting to be quiet afterwards. If it's AE be damned. Now, I, re I definitely need Holland. And I definitely have to break their... They already broke that alliance, right? Yeah, then now they have no big nasty alliances. They have no alliances, for that matter. Why am I getting... Cur uh, okay. I hate my research. Zero pro progress. Zero progress. Zero progress. That's my, my forts. His... Ten. Started at the same time. That's how it feels, at least. Mm -hmm. I'm lying, but... Okay. He has four siege pro progress. Um, where he is, and we have four, zero, zero. Well, this is a very old discussion between you and I, and the fact that you know, we can get a, a huge artillery army with a six siege general pull them up on a castle and spend spend a year besieging it, and they can have a couple of rebels with no leader knock the same size fort down in a matter of just days. Yeah, the problem is my allies can't seem to actually go and kill his army, which would be, be make this war go away, but uh, we'll see. I have to just have to, I just have to be patient. As soon as his... My fear is that as soon as his Siege of Liege finishes, I'm gonna be dead. I'm gonna be toast. Toasty. I'll be toasty. And pro relations with you, sir. You still have land I can steal, so I'm gonna be nice to you. So let's see, yeah. <laughs> Portugal, I don't think you're gonna win that war. For that matter, I don't think Castile will win their war either. And the winner of both of those wars would be France. New Pounds Bohemia. Ah, that's what you did, Mr. Empire. Emperor. Emperor. Yes. Isn't it? Emperor. Mr. Emperor. Yeah. 
Let's see, there's a six. Ooh, seven. Come on. Two, two. Oh, we're actually making progress. Miracles do happen. And you take two. Uh, yeah, there are some issues. The Netherlands are fully defensive, so yeah, there's that. They're also fully full on quality. And they have siege ability as part of their ideas. That's so yeah. A, that sounds fruitful. Yeah, there, there, there are plenty of reasons why they pre pretty much murdered me. They're two techs ahead. They have at least 20% infantry combat ability. From, yeah. So, yeah. And they had a 3 fire leader, so... I shouldn't have been surprised, really, that they murdered me as badly as, as they did, but... Oh, well. Let's see, how many ships do I still have at this point? Not enough. I, that sounds about right. Now I have... 34 heavy ships. Not gonna be enough if I don't upgrade them. Uh, you, I can upgrade. Yeah, sure, you upgrade. Oh, all the ships I built were... Okay. Yeah, okay, upgrade them. Maybe I shouldn't do that. I should probably go with the... Uh, Carax first, if I still have any. Maybe I should go with the early Carax. The good fortune. Yeah, you haven't been good fortune. Maybe you have. You haven't sunk. It's high, no, you're no kidding. Uh -huh. I'm going to buy down by two, yeah. Insane, but I'm going to do it anyway. And it sounds like Perry is having cat issues. <laughs> oh. No, she's in one of her moods where she just goes around and either paws at any cardboard she can find or licks any piece of paper she can find. And I unfortunately have a stack of paper on my desk I'd rather she not lick. Oh no. Oh, yes. Ooh. No, they found my spy. Uh oh. That's what the, the slight edge I had. Uh, something like 95% spy network. That kind of helped my siege. That's sad. 95% uh, chance. Uh, oh, there goes Liege again. I built 15 ships, uh, light ships for just naval escort, for trade escort, and it puts me over my, my, my cap. My, my naval cap is that small. You should just, go for one of the naval ideas then to boost your. I, I would love to have the freedom to go for naval ideas. However, my neighbors have voted otherwise. Yay! I actually took the war goal. Me happy. Me so very very happy. Now I just have to, the others have to fall, and I'll be, even happier. And where the heck did they send their army? No place good. Yeah, that sounds about right. But not in any other wars, but yeah, they... 50k duchies on the march somewhere. And I don't know where. But the Brandenburgian space marines are trying to chase them down wherever they went. Let's see for peace. Spy network. Okay, back in October. Oh, there they are. Have you made friends? Ah, uh, no, they're just beelining for uh, Bavaria. 
Bavaria with their level two forts. So yeah, I can kind of understand why they went why they went that way. On the bright side of things, you haven't died yet. There's that. Yes, that's definitely a positive. Yes, it's a it's a strong positive. You should build, <laughs> you should build on that. Event isn't our army grand. Uh, I've seen your army. I'm not impressed. <laughs> And over with the Dutch. The Dutch were very unimpressed. No, 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 what did he do? Oh, no. <laughs> ah. Now my Polish friends had sieged down their fort to, like, six or seven progress, and then they decided, hey, let's move. Because oh, there was a battle on the far end of the continent. Ah. All that siege progress lost. Why you do this to me, allies? Ah. Well, okay, it's fine. Let you. You can bleed manpower. Try to kill his army. And you might actually succeed. Huh. They might succeed where I failed miserably. Oh boy. Parallel authority. That doesn't sound pleasant. So do I make... Uh, what points do I need more? Do I, can I get diplomatic points? No. Oh, new world charter. I completely forgot to do that. Uh, I can't do that either. Eight, that's several years. Ah. Uh. Uh. I lost a general. Oh, sorry to hear that. I assume it was a good general. Uh, probably my better one. Oh yeah, it was a good one. Dutch Dantes. Uh, come on, Dutchies. You must die. I wanted to settle a colony just to annoy my allies and create my colonial Mexico. Now what should that be called, hmm? A Dutch Mexico. Well, one of my better and stranger friends is Family was Dutch and Mexican, so we you could just call it Mike, but uh, <laughs> or actually, in his case, Evil Mike. But yeah, we'll see. That's but no, I don't call. have a, don't have anything for you. I have to think about it. We actually managed to unseat our own capital. Woohoo! And now he's coming to kill us. Woohoo! Please don't come and kill me. Yes, you're coming to kill me. Everything, move there, now. We're defending, and it's farmlands. Of course you attack me in farmlands. My entire army versus yours. Oh boy. Ugly. And Poland's are just... They're just sitting and watching. Oh, this... I hate this conquistador. But I really thought they said that conquistadors would get 
less a combat penalty in Europe, but I'm not seeing that. My yeah. God, is it tough? Well, I'm, think back to early in the game when you had an explorer and, and Christopher Columbus, who basically yeah. was the bane and the, was the dread pirate Roberts <laughs> of Western Europe for 40 years. Yeah, you're right. Stay there, and the rest of you go back together. Some defense in depth. I'm still sieging this fort, am I? Actually, I'm not. Okay, in that case, send the mercs in. Siege of Antwerp, that's gonna be painful. It's at minus 84 at the moment. Level 8 forts. Yay. Glad, glad I haven't had to deal with those yet. Are you ready to fight the Commonwealth? Just asking. Tentatively. I should be. Okay. I'm going to let you know as soon as this war is drawing to an end. It's going to last a while longer. The only thing that's going to end this would be... Uh, uh, taking wars... Uh, the... Uh, yeah. The uh, call for peace, and the Pope rivals France. Okay. Well, that's a pretty solid papal state. Oh my goodness, yeah, you're right. They could, they think they're getting close to the Kingdom of Heaven. I don't know if the, pa the Pope ever actually forms it, but... And where did the, did the Dutch Navy go? Warriors do not need to read books. Okay. Obviously, obviously, Clausewitz and Sun Tzu were not warriors. Oh no, I guess uh, they, I guess they wrote books. Lost one stability point. I needed that stability point. Boo. Okay. Buying it back up. I need to be at zero. I don't want to be at minus. Minus anything. Uh, your two deckers. Let's see, how many obsolete ships do I have here? Do I have more early characters? Yeah, I'll have to spend a lot of time just rebuilding my navy here. Oh. What? Oh, you actually took... Oh, I didn't realize that. Okay. Not much I can do about that. And this is... That's where your, the Dutch Navy went. Hopefully, once I've started sieging their territory, their fleet will start sinking. Ooh, 50,000... Oh, that's Riga. Never mind. I thought, thought Livonian Order just got a giant rebellion. Ah, they're coming again! Fight them, fight them! Go, 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 go! Yes, Brandenburg, come, Brandenburg, Bavaria, come on, pile in, pile in! We must kill, we must kill! Everybody get in here! I don't know if you played <laughs> Hearthstone after they got that card. Oh, I haven't played Hearthstone in a long time. Yeah. Everybody get in here! I, really... I, lost, I lost so much of my soul back to uh, the Magic of the Gathering back when it was out that uh, I was hesitant to dive back in with, with uh, Hearthstone. Yeah, some of the ships have been upgraded now. They could might well be the same ships that that uh, Columbus stole for us. Oh, you know. <sighs> yeah, back in the time with Life was simpler. <laughs> oh. When you were young and optimistic. Mecklenburg, yeah, sure. Have access. 
Now the army I have arrayed on the Commonwealth's border is equal in size to their standing army plus their manpower. <laughs> yeah. There's seven, se seven core of 23,000 men each. And they're busy attritioning themselves. Oh boy. Well, the fort of uh, Amsterdam and uh, Antwerpen is now down to 70% minus. You're winning, though. <laughs> and at 0% progress. I like the French Alliance Network. Ottomans, Colombia, and Corsica. Yeah, I like that much better. And that's why I wanted to force them out of the Alliance, because then they would get new ones that are rubbish. And they definitely succeeded there. Well, come on, forts. Yeah. The Polish siege is going much faster. They're at seven. See? No. Still zero progress. Status quo. So let's see. Chances of die rolls. What are they? They are. 7% chance of disease outbreak. 35% chance of supply shortage, and that's it. So every 30, yeah, every 30 days, the siege has at one in three chances of progressing. Okay. So yeah, it's gonna take a while. That, or I'm gonna have to pile up with a ton more artillery. Yeah, I might have to do that soon, build a basically a siege stack. I've been hesitant in doing that. Why is that? Cash flow. And that's why I'm so desperate after getting Holland at the very least. Because then I get the then I get to secure the trade node I need. That's why I'm doing this. I just want Holland, preferably Antwerpen, if I can, and maybe Zeeland. At least. That, that would be the minimum I want. Of course that's gonna trigger some real hoopla. Trigger what? Well, I have a truce with France for another six years, so... Plus 20, that's a lot. Oh, he's tempting. That is tempting. Oh, I can always... Let's see, nobles, yeah. Hmm... They have a lot of influence, though. Yeah, what's the worst that can happen? <laughs> I can go back to my threatening provinces. Oh! Your, your hobby resumes. Can I do the same with Scandinavia at this point? They got pretty mauled in that war. I could go look. Just saying. Does you like doing that? It's a, not a bad process. It's slow. That's the only big. That's the biggest downside to it. So duchies. I can't with Navy. I don't have any claims. Yeah, there's that too. Huh. I do like that. I'm now third in army size. That's kind of. Unsuspected, uh, unex unexpected, unsuspected. Yeah, a little low. unsuspected. No, well, you're third and fourth limit. Mm -hmm. How far down is France now? They must have recovered by now. Fifty-two thousand soldiers. Yeah, just above Portuguese Mexico. Orissa as, as fourth. Yeah, India is very consolidated. And Portugal is still losing their war, yes. Losing both their wars. No, okay, they... Oh, yeah. The African alliance seems to be losing. So Morocco is continuing their migration south, it seems. <laughs> when Morocco when Morocco reaches Congo, let me know. No, then they'll have to go through me. I wouldn't recommend that. And yeah, now the siege is at minus 84, yeah. They, I honestly don't think I 
can siege this one. The way things are going, oh. Yeah, if I'm gonna have anything, I need to build a stack of 25 artillery or something just to make make progress, really. That's how bad these forts are. Do 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 do. I has the war goal. Yes, 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 yes. You can gain eighteen point two more war score. That's good. Where the heck did their army go? Oh! Oh! Oh, this could get ugly. <laughs> Problem? The Dutch army boarded their navy. Oh. And they're sailing out. I'm not sure where, but yeah. I think my colonies are gonna have a fun, fun time soon. At least it'll be brutal and ugly. And uh, I don't know. They. Oh, yeah, that's probably why. Commonwealth landed in Brazil. Okay. <laughs> Commonwealth sent a stack of six troops to Brazil. That's, yeah. that's kind of a, of a neat gambit. Yeah, but it succeeded. Got their entire you know, navy and fleet. Everyone there is going down there. I think they might lose their navy, though, because they're probably going to run into the Dutch on the, the way home. Like the Cape Verde approach. Oh, good, good lord! I'm down to one one uh, wrong religion province in my whole territory. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Given how big you start out as. Yeah. And my diplomacy tech has gotten so high had gotten so far ahead I've been throwing my diplomacy at culture conversions so there's a lot of them. Oh, I'm far behind in tech. I don't have such luxuries. Oh, I'm behind too in tech. I mean, I, the Chinese make me look look like I'm a beginner. The 24, 22, 23. I have a decent heir and I have a decent king, so I'm relatively con con bah, relatively content. There we go. Occasionally I can get a word out. Ugh. How do you really feel? Okay, this is ugly. I'm gonna... You're gonna go home. Disband. This rate I probably should detach everything else too. Or is that 2.7 just from uh, mild defensive due to siege? Yeah. But okay. The trade good of Westvigden, that's in. Yeah. Ivory. Not exactly the trade good I expected to show up in Greenland. Ivory, you can get it from like the narwhals. Yeah, well, and the narwhals. Yeah. It was. A, that's why. Yeah, the narwhals were used for ivory. wasn't wasn't as effective a source as say, oh, I don't know, elephants. Uh, Netherlands, come on! Did you find an invincible fort? Uh, someday the fort for will fall, but I can't even imagine when that'll happen. Defensive mentality. Ah, uh, yeah. Fort defense minus 13. Not that it matters. Let's see, I have... Yeah, do I want to risk... 
One second, when it... Oh, is it time? It is time. I've been doing something risky. My entire fleet, trying to bunch them together and see if I can... Siege a little bit. Oh well. Before the Dutch Navy comes to kill you. Yeah, I prob they're probably already on the way back, so we'll see. Might I just feed them victory points now? Oh well. Well, we'll take a short break and we'll be right back. Thanks for watching. <laughs>